uh, we know of the situation that happened to us of um, Sister Uche Abadulo. Um, like we said, it's a very unfortunate situation and um, we've never experienced anything at this level before. Of course, we've had death of people, but um, this, the reason why is that she's a member of the board of the church, and um, which of course is the highest body of the church. We've never experienced anything at this level before. And so our burial is on Friday and Saturday. So Friday is the service of song in this place at six o'clock. Friday at six o'clock, there will be a service of song uh, for, her, for her here. And on, um, on Saturday at 10 o'clock, I believe 10 o'clock, it will be the, um, in this place here, yeah, 10 o'clock, it will be the burial ceremony. And so let's come and honor her. That's what we can give to her. You know, like I said, we do not know the day of her visitation, but we know she died as a saint. It might be pain for us here, but the Bible makes it clear, the death of the saints, they rejoice in heaven. And uh, all of us are going to die. I know you won't say amen, but it's a fact. It's just that we will go at different times. That is it. We will all die. I'm telling you, I'm not afraid. And that's just the truth. I'm not. Because it's the people you leave behind. It's not you. The dead are dead. They don't know anything. And that's it. So we pray that we will not live when we are not supposed to live. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And so we want to celebrate our life. And our own going. She's going home. That's it. She has gone home. And so we want to celebrate our home going. She had so much impact. Uh, the mother was talking to my wife on the other day, and she said that she was the first person who got a PhD in, um, in electrical engineering from Temple. She was the first lady who got the PhD in electrical engineering in Temple University. You understand? You know, that's, a, that's an amazing thing. And um, she, got, she got her PhD at 26. You understand? And um, it's because, you know, we, God, we have days that God has given to us. And so it's not about the quantity. It's about the quality. Praise the Lord. And also, please, I know we, the time has gone. We need to introduce the Biazo Committee very briefly to us. Amen. Biazo Committee. Let them come. Amen. Please, let's clap for them. Yeah. We are having Biazo. We are going to have Biazo this um, 2017. We're going to have a Biazo, and um, this is uh, the people who are part of our Biazo. Amen. Praise the Lord. Um, Biazo, Biazo is going to happen in April. The whole of April is going to be our Biazo, and we're expecting a wonderful time. We are, of course, we're expecting Dr. Mensa Otabio back, Reverend George, and some other people are going to be here. Praise the Lord. And so, please, some of them will be approaching us, and when they approach us, um, they will, um, let's be open to them for whatever they need us to do. Praise the Lord. Um, Brother Olatunji is the chairman of the, uh, of the committee, amen. You want to say something to us? Yes. Good morning, church. Good morning. Good afternoon, afternoon. Oh, well, afternoon. <laughs> uh, well, I will, we would like to thank uh, Pastor Gandhi, Pastor Moore, and the leadership uh, for giving us this unique opportunity uh, to be able to champion this exciting and impactful event. Um, Biazo 2017, as Pastor said, will be taking place in the month of April. Uh, we have a lot of programs lined up, a lot of activities. We're asking that, um, you know, we're just asking for your prayers and your support. Um, we're also going to be reaching out to different HODs and the workers within those departments, and we'll be needing the assistance as well. And finally, we're just looking for people that would like to assist in any way. If you'd like to assist us in any way, please reach out to us. Thank you so much for your time, and God bless you. Praise the Lord. Uh, Bimbo, please come. Um, thank you. Please, let's clap for them. It's a lot of work. And those of us who have served in the Beyonce community, we know what it is like. Amen. It's a one-month-long program, and they've been meeting, and uh, we are believing in the Lord that uh, this year, uh, next year, is going to be very great. Amen. Uh, you know, we want to make our normal monthly presentation 
about our building. And um, we want to make that presentation. We want to encourage us, please, that let's give towards this project. All we have asked is that if all of us will give $100 every month, it will go a long way. That is $100 for our Thanksgiving. And so you, you let us set it aside and give $100 for the Lord. It goes a long way for us. Amen. It goes a long way. And God will help you and God will bless you. And as we are building for the Lord, the Lord will build our own homes also. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Praise the Lord. Once again, we want to appreciate everyone for your giving. And uh, God will continually increase you in the name of Jesus. God will enlarge your territory in the mighty name of Jesus. Um, you know, we, uh, the, the update for the month of November, if you, if you just go through the slides, please, quickly. The uh, goal for 2016 was now $15,000. And like Pastor Gandhi was saying, I think the, uh, the, the goal was, the objective was to have each person give $100 during, uh, when we do our Thanksgiving offering. And that if we can collect that, at least we'll get close to the goal and we can also add from the normal operating fund. Uh, go to the next slide. Okay, for the month of November, we uh, got $31,000 from the Thanksgiving offering and I mean, additional funds that came in during the month of November was $1,280. And we uh, added $47,000 from the operating, the regular operating funds. And uh, to God be the glory, we're able to make our November 2016 uh, mortgage savings update. So from 9-15, We've, been, we've done $835,000 to the glory of God. Please, let's give yourself. Let's just celebrate God for his faithfulness. And we have very little to go. Amen? Next. And so we have $80,000 left to reach our goal for 2016. And as you can see, God is indeed a faithful God. You know, God has been good. We set a goal, and God made it possible. Uh, God made it possible for us to reach it. And I know that by the end of the year, we will do more than a 915 in Jesus' name. And I just want to encourage you today, as you give today, as you give towards this, like I always say, I have done it. I'm telling you, I'm a testament to what God is doing. I tied my giving towards this project to something and god is indeed doing great and mighty things i, I just want you to tie this to something today as you as i mean as we're preparing a thanksgiving offering today tie it to something and also thank god in advance for the thing and trust me the god that has said it is faithful to perform it and i can tell you you will stand and testify to his goodness in december of course in january when we stand there and say this is done. You also will testify that, yes, that thing I told him about, that thing I tied this giving to will be accomplished in the name of Jesus. And I want to thank you again for your giving. So as we prepare our Thanksgiving offering, you know, at least we want everybody, each person here, to give $100 towards this. And God will bless you as you do in the name of Jesus. At this time, I want to uh, call on our new guest our new guest, we, we have a short reception for you. Please, let's clap for our new guest. Our new guest, we thank you. We, work, we thank you. And please, do you have anybody upstairs, anybody in the gallery, new, anybody worshiping with us for the first time? Our new guest, if you're up there, please, we have a short reception for you. Please, let's, please, let's clap for our new guest. We want to thank you. We appreciate you for coming. Thank you very much. Thank you for coming. Thank you. The choir, are you guys ready for Thanksgiving? Are you up? Please let's come here for Thanksgiving. All right. Well, it's time for our Thanksgiving offering. Let's come rejoicing and celebrating as we take our Thanksgiving offering.
Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The Lord is good. All the time. And all the time. Good. Let us rise as we praise the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. Come and see the Lord is good. 